Warren, I'm sure you're you're very probably probably embarrassed that, after that this evening. Uh, I think embarrassed is an, is an understatement. Um, angry, frustrated. I think you know a huge amount of emotions, and um, I just think we come off a good bounce from Friday night, and, and ideally we were hoping to carry that through, and, and probably did for big parts of the first half. I don't think there was a huge amount um, in the game at half time. Um, but for me, it's black and white, and I've said it in there, and, I, and I'm, I'll say it out here as well, that sadly when the second goal goes in 48, 49 minutes, whatever it may be, for some reason we down tools, and, and people just drop right off it. And I can count on one hand over the years if I've ever had to stand here and talk about something like that. But whether I like it or not, tonight the players did. Um, and it's not acceptable. You know, we've been here a huge amount of times over the last couple of seasons. We've had some ding dong battles. We've gone ahead in some of them. Uh, we've gone behind. Two 0 seemed to be that scoreline quite a few times over the years, and we pull it back to at least two all, or at least we have have that fight and energy and everything that goes with it. And tonight we didn't, in simple terms. And whether I like it or not, um, I'm not going to stand here and try and crowd over it. Um, from the for me, from the minute that goal went in, as as a group, you know, the, the players. They didn't step up to it, and it's it's really embarrassing and disappointing. And I can only apologise to everybody who's travelled up the road tonight. Off the back of travelling up the road as well on a Friday night, it's a massive ask. It's it's one that I'm well aware of in relation to the distances that, that we ask people to do to come and follow. And it's simple, you know, the least that those guys can ask for is a bit of pride um, and is that fight. And no matter what, there's 90, 94 minutes of energy and fight and graft and everything else. Which, to be fair, a lot of times we generally do get, but we have to be honest, it wasn't there tonight. Yeah, and obviously there's a few, um, obviously Dean Jarvis was suspended and there's a few injured as well, and do you expect to get them in the, in the back any time soon? Jarvis, Jarvis obviously just a, um, a suspension, so ideally, you know, he'll come back for Saturday. Um, with that, I don't know, Jamie's gone down again tonight, we'll have to go and get um, that look better at in the morning as well. So. Um, it's not ideal from that point of view, but listen, other teams have had injuries, other teams throughout the league have had their bits and pieces and everything else, we're no different. Um, we had 11 players out in that pitch tonight that we had absolute faith in, and in simple terms they didn't step, didn't step up and didn't deliver. And now there definitely has to be a reaction on Saturday as, as Crusaders are. are yeah, there should be, I'm got it, and I'm sure every fan driving down that road, and people even who weren't at the game tonight are, are got it as well. It dents the pride, it, it hurts, it hurts a huge amount. Um, and I've said that to all the players, they've got to go away and take a real hard look at themselves in the mirror. And they've really got to step up because if they're going to go out on Saturday with their tail between their legs against Crusaders, um, well, they're in for one really tough day. Cheers, one.